Hello, everybody. I think I'm about ready to get started. So we last left off right before we get to play Pick an Ending. So we're going to beat Dawn quite a few times tonight. Hopefully everybody is doing well. Let me go ahead and set up the game. See if this behaves. We'll eventually find the one that I put it on. There we go. I found it eventually. It's okay, it was booting up anyway. Oh, is it gonna tell me that every time I go to load the game? That's not great. It's the first time we've had to reload our data. Oh, I love, I love my signature, by the way. It's certainly something. Like, mmm, the pinnacle, followed by whatever you want to call that on the screen. Okay. So I believe we were at the point where I literally just have to reach the other place. We're good to go. healing. Just warming up a little bit. Welcome in, Parameter. That instantly kills. Honestly, Mandragora kind of invalidates most of the other souls. I find it more useful for casual play. I want to say there's an item over here. Hold on, chat. We're going to check real quick. Oh, okay. There was. Okay. I don't remember if we got this last time. What I was curious about is you could pick up the Durandal here. So I guess if I wasn't crafting, this would have been our only real weapon upgrade, which as you can see, it's pretty weak compared to what we're using. Like, it's decent, don't get me wrong, but like, really not on the same tier as the Dane's Leaf. like other tech for movement. I just don't remember offhand. I don't think I need to do anything in this room. It could go this way. Hopefully everybody's doing well. Oh, that didn't actually kill. Oh, hello. by Alistor. And a prism should be full MP recovery. I think our goal is just to go upwards. I don't super remember the maps that well. But definitely apologies for going places I don't need to go. Oh. This. Hold on, is that just regular Lance? Oh, they're out of their minds. Why would I ever use this? I guess if I really didn't find another weapon, I guess I would do it. Okay, our goal is to go up, but what's in this room? Oh. <laughs> right, chat, that, 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 that was a big no- Oh, come on, bat form. Bat form, why are you so whack in this game? It is definitely the worst bat form in all the games. O honestly, unless I'm misremembering something from Portrait of Ruin, I guess technically Owl might be worse. Welcome to FG, hope you're doing well. Yeah, definitely not a fan of bat in this game. I hate that startup animation that it has. Like, you're as big as uh, Soma while in the transformation state, and you're not allowed to move, and then you're allowed to move afterwards. Kinda crappy. Oh, 
wall. That was just for money. How unfortunate. Uh, so that was not the way to go. gonna say. Vandergore just seems to take care of the problem, as it were. Is there something too close to me? Doesn't matter. Hmm. Oh, that's convenient. Hopefully everybody's doing well. Our goal is to go to, to the up and left. As I said before, my map awareness of this game is pretty low. We, we've exhausted about what I remember of the game. I, I know I eventually have to go to the southeast. Okay, I don't think it's in this room. It might be the next room. I know there's also something hidden in the ceiling near the boss itself. It might literally be in the boss room. That's the extent of my knowledge on the game. Oh, we actually got the soul. Oh. Doing great, how am I doing? Uh, not great, honestly. Feeling kind of bad the whole week. Another one of these rooms, I don't think I care what's on the other side. Just doing a, doing a ceiling check real quick. Okay, nothing there. Ah, uh, here it is. Like, uh, it's like an accessory. Also a sword here. Why would I ever use this? Just... We're, we're gonna pretend I didn't pick up that item. <laughs> Just leave that disappointment over here. Is it like Satan's ring? Yeah, there we go. I remembered an item, chat. You should feel proud. I lose one defense, but I gain in. I guess that's fine. I guess that's worth. I'll take the in and damage increase. I mean, Tear of Blood is so strong that honestly, I could see like why I wouldn't switch it necessarily. So we have the Dane's Leaf and this. Uh, I could try to get away with Devil. I mean, like, I do need to use it more. It is, like, the best blue soul in the game, but it's, like, I don't know. I'm just not a big thing. If, I'm just not a big fan of things that drain HP, especially when you don't, like, play the game. Oh, no. Hold on, chat. I just remember the most important thing. Uh, how do I do that seal? <laughs> like, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Yes, I would like to practice. It kind of sucks that it doesn't just, like, show you the order here ahead of time. I gotta write this out again. So it's Y. I gotta click this. Thanks. Thanks, game. I'm taking notes and also typing at the same time. So it's Y. Left button. B. Like, I have to write this out, which is annoying. I, I don't have my notes from last time, sadly. So Y, left button, B, A, X, R, B. A, X, right button. I'm glad they made this annoying chat. Mm. Oops. That time that was my fault. If I look at my notes, it's Y, left button, B, A, X, right button, Y, A. Oh, that's not too bad. Y, okay, there we go. No, I would not like to keep practicing. And now I have to keep my notes up so I can actually read it while we play. There we go. We, we have figured it out. All right, so we're going to go for the bandit. Well, one of the bad endings first. What took you so long? Hmm, let's finish this. I'll show you why you can't become the Dark Lord. Ugh, even Belmont was no match for me. Think a punk like you can win? Was there ever any doubt? Power is nothing if you don't know how to use it. 
I'll never lose to a fool dominated by his own power like you. Also, sadly, we got the bugbear soul, but I don't think we're going to save it. <laughs> because I, I don't remember if it was before or after the save. Well, what's the point of power if you don't use it? Don't act as if you know. It's about survival of the fittest. Let's see you try to survive this time. Uh! Oh, out of range. I think I know what to do. We get to practice. There we go. I did it. I did the strat. I did it correctly. I can actually hit him. That's not what I meant to do. The behind. Oh. That was fast. Oh, is it automatic? When oh, it's automatic when you get the bayonet ending. Ah ha 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 ha, indeed. More power. Okay, that wasn't too bad. So, so I had a theory, and I did remember the strategy, so I'm gonna reiterate for people that want the easiness for that fight. Regardless if it's this phase or the other one, it's the same principle. If he's facing to the right, I hang on his left, right? So his back is to me. His first column will go behind him. Then I kind of stay in the middle, force him to put a pillar in the middle with the second one. His third one can only go a little more right than that. So I could put myself within sword distance with it. So I'm sure there's like a little, little more cleanness I could do with the movement, but I did actually do it correctly there. Or at least I got it close enough that I could still hit with the big sword, which is all that matters. So I just got like free two, three hit swings. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, I was kind of butterfingers on which one was my devil button due to like literally not using it the entire game. I forgot what button it was on the controller. I'm not going to lie. I was like, is it Y? No, that's swap. <laughs> I was like, is it RB? Okay, it's RB. I cut off the power from the darkness using a magical seal. Give up. It's over. What? Get away from him, Soma. No! I'm not gonna lie, chat. That is a face. That that is definitely an emote. Look at it. <laughs> uh, that is something, chat. He couldn't resist the demon that had fused with his soul. You're saying he lost to the demon's power? He perhaps could have been saved if the demon was cut free from his soul, but... Don't let it concern you. That's just what happens when you let your hunger for power overwhelm you. Yeah, that's a good candidate for exclamation mark no, for sure. Dot dot dot. Ericardo, what became of Celia? I'm sorry. We have units tracking her whereabouts now. Hmm. So we're done here. Let's get out of here. Anyway, we beat the game, so GG. Ugh. What's wrong, Soma? Nothing. I just felt something odd for a moment. Hmm. Anything strange happened in the castle? N no, nothing. Wait. Come to think of it, when I fought Dimitri, there was something weird. Go on. Never finished him off, but he died anyway. That's when I felt something enter me, like a soul under domination. We'll have to investigate. Come, we'll meet with Yoko right away and, and head for the church. Something happening to me? I don't know, but we'll know soon enough. And then you never learn. Data has been saved. Yay. Well, that was easy, chat. <laughs> even, even with the Butterfingers boss fight, that boss fight was very easy. The fact that Devil was doing like 220 something was kind of insane. I definitely could have killed him in like a third of the swings. <clears throat> I believe the images we're seeing in the in the upper corner is if I got the soul, it'll show up. If I don't have the soul, I think it's just blanks. Yeah, speaking of which. So yeah, we're gonna go for all endings, so ending one of three done. Like we're just slowly scrolling up in the background. <clears throat> Yeah, 
You know what the worst part is, chat? I took all that time to do the seal, and you know there's another seal. <laughs> I'm d I, I literally need it for one fight, <laughs> this, this seal, and then we're immediately going to another seal level. This kind of sucks. Thanks, Dawn of Sorrow. The real sorrow is realizing you have to write down another set of uh, inputs. There's always another seal, exactly. Sadly, we're not going to keep that bugbear soul. Fortunately, we did save the other weapon if we really needed it. So yeah, I could see like if we had Devil there, <clears throat> we wouldn't need the weapon we have now. But given that I don't enjoy using Devil, it kind of offsets me not using Devil. Like we have a genuinely good weapon due to crafting something earlier. Words that are not often spoken on the stream. Oh, it's trying to do all the bosses, but we skipped them. You ready for the gap? Yeah, look at the gap. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> right now, oops, where are the other bosses? Where'd they go? Oh, there you go. There's our scribble. I'd be surprised you need to seal at the end of the credits. Damn. <laughs> did you did you like those blanks for those bosses? Should have been, chat. We'll go back and fight them, I guess, when we're done done with the game. Mm-hmm. That's not flight. Oh, it remembered my devil? Oh, it actually saved- it actually saved my progress and my items? I didn't realize that was a thing. Does that mean I have the bugbear soul? Oh. That's thoughtful of them, I guess. Good, I don't need to re-equip anything. Alright, let's go fight the real boss. Yeah, I don't know what the trick is with Dive Kick. I know there's something you could do to prevent the slide. Alright, gotta switch one of them briefly to Paranoia, which I guess I could just make it this one. Why am I not? There it is. <laughs> it's here somewhere. Maybe I wasn't close enough. Thought I was close enough. Uh, that sucks. Alright. His pattern at least is pretty simple. I'm just gonna jump strike him repeatedly. And then I just have to be careful with the whoosh. He's not super hard. Oh, I forgot about the fireball. <laughs> I forgot he had another attack. I'm not gonna lie, chat. I 100% thought he had no other attacks. Whoops. Fine, let's get out of there. On the plus side, we are at least using double. Downside, my aim is atrocious. And when he's going overhead. While he's going overhead. I slid the wrong direction. That is so annoying. That's why I don't like Devil. That right there, chat. That feeling when I hold down and then right, but I accidentally hit left for a brief second because I was rolling my finger and I died. Thanks, Devil. I hate that so much. Yeah, that's why I don't like using it. Wait, what? You can't dive kick on those? Why? Why can't you diagonal dive kick on that? That's whack. Yeah, I just don't like having to... Like, if... I don't mind, t like, having, like, three hits and I die, but one hit and I die is just not enjoyable to me from, like, a gameplay standpoint. And that's why. Like, I'll mess up inevitably.
Yeah, I don't know. Sometimes there's weird hitboxes like that, so fortunately we don't rely on dive kick for anything important. Alright, so we have this. If there's anything else I really want to do here. I, I don't know why I went in the corner again. That was a mistake. Like, it's not hard to dodge. It's just if you happen to slide the wrong direction, you just die. Oh, speaking of which, I just got punished. Interesting. Did you see that? Did my sword just straight up go through him? What was that? Hello? Whatever. Very tanky. Jeez. Are you gonna do another attack or is this just is this my life now? Oh yeah, there we go. There we go. Cleanish. Oh, it won't let me leave. What did you do, punk? My power, it's gone. I destroyed the demon that fused with your soul, and your power with it. My... my power! Having power doesn't necessarily mean you're strong. Haven't you learned your lesson? I. It's quite a scream. You are much more than I had imagined. I came as I promised. Let's stop this stupid chase. Very well, I can agree to that. Don't seem to be too concerned about this. It's as if you knew this was going to happen. Well, who am I to say? But there is more than one way to make a Dark Lord. You don't give up, do you? There aren't any more Dark Lord candidates. I think he would not agree to that. Yeah, something like that. That may be true, but the game isn't over just yet. No, no that was earlier, Celia, when I bopped my head on the uh, fist. The center of the castle. I shall wait for you there. Another trap? But we're gonna end this. Trust me, we will. But first, there's something that I wish you to see. I shall be waiting. I mean, we could just easily just shoot her with something. I'm just saying. And we're warming up still a little to the game. Stupid BS seal. There's so many inputs. Listen, Chad, I'm not going to remember this. It's like... Y... LB... B... I just need to see what the actual buttons are, because I just don't... I just don't even, like, know 100%. I just want to make sure. So it's Y, L, B... X... A... B... RB, then shenanigans happen. What happens when it goes to shenanigan? So Y, L, X, Y again, Y, X, Y, X, game please. 
I'm trying to take notes here. Y L B X A R B. A oh, it's A Y. Oh. I wrote this wrong. It's annoying because it's very deep in the chain and I can't- I wish there was no timer, honestly. Like, when you're just trying to learn it, I don't get why there's a timer. Y, L, B, X, A, B, R, B, Y, X, R, B. I missed R, B there. It's R, B, A, Y. Okay. So I just want to, without looking at the screen, I just want to make sure these inputs are correct. No, I would like to not keep practicing. <laughs> like, no thank you, right, chat? Oh, what was that? Straight downwards dive. Interestingly, it doesn't have any land lag. It just instantly jumps out. I guess if I just look at a fall... He'll give you the buttons, and that's all you'll get. I mean, it felt kind of like that. Oh, now you want a dive kick? Whatever. Chad, is that not what I did earlier? <laughs> just, like, it, is it just, is it just hitbox magic? Alright, so we gotta find our way to an exit. I actually don't remember. Does chat remember if there's a warp up here to save me the long walk to the south? I am curious what's up here before we go further. Okay, that time it worked. Box magic, a hitbox shank. It's certainly something. What is this guy even guarding? Just more money? That is super lame. Well, anyway, that was not worth checking. Just curious. Alright, so I have to go all the way down. Of course, I got hit that time. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'll take the damage boosts, to be honest with you. As long as they go in the correct direction. That did not go in the correct direction. I could not imagine wanting to 100% this map. Between with how slow Bat is and all these like really annoying areas, like nah. You can keep your map clear. I didn't go this way. I'm just curious what's over here. Then we'll move on. Oh. Um. I do have electricity though, right? From somebody. My brain is trying to remember which one was electricity. It's not Zephyr. It was like one of the whatever the spear chucker was called. Oh there it is. For you, Kuda. Oh, does that now count? Oh it does, okay. I was gonna say we gotta kill Mothman real quick. I don't even think I showed him off last time. Look at that death animation. Could you imagine farming his soul? I sure don't. You're baffled how deep some of the movement options were in this game? Yeah, they are really deep in this game for no reason. Huge missed opportunity from them. I don't know what they were thinking. Like, ha, huh, we got Black Panther. Remember that? It's everybody's favorite. Final, like, three rooms of the game. Let's go. I could see this being more enjoy. Wow, it carries negative momentum. Like, if I'm falling, it carries it. That sucks. Because I, like, jump, but I, like, slip briefly, and that caused me to go downwards. Man, Bat feels so terrible in this game. Especially after playing something like Soden, it feels really bad.
There we go. We got through. Hmm. Okay, if I go to a warp, we shut off the Yeti last time. We just did the electricity. I guess I could try one more time for Succubus, and then we're moving on. Okay, I'm not, I'm not bothering. I tried, Chad. That was my one genuine attempt to get Succubus again after not getting it for a while. I would like to do the Succubus glitch, but I don't feel like spending 30 minutes to get it. I believe it was right here, so it should be quick to show off. You can go that fast to get all the stuff you're never going to use. That's very true. Yeah, I was talking before. I forget what I called it. I think I said Flying Humanoid. Not this screen. I think it's the next screen. I think all I legitimately need is Mandragora. So let's put Mandragora on. Here we go. Look at it come to us, chat. Ten out of ten. I could go get the Konami Man and stuff, but I don't know. It's, it's kind of whatever. We don't have the uppercut to go to the bells. I could technically go get some items that we missed. Like, I think there's a decent one in the Dark Chapel. Like, one of the rooms that if you go down here, it gives you, like, a big attack boost. It's like Molnir or something. It's like a belt. But anyway, um, I don't think I really care. <laughs> our weapon is so strong, I don't think it matters. And I'm also not really going to be using our weapon anymore. That was the last boss where our weapon kind of matters. I guess technically it could matter in the next one, but honestly... I'm going to be alternating in and damage anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Um, We'll worry about the bonus stuff later. Let's go to the Garden of Madness, Madness and save. We'll come back for the bottom left corner of the screen. When we're truly done with the game, we'll come back. And we could come back using Black Panther. We'll, we'll actually make it have a, a purpose in our playthrough. Man, I love Katana, and I hate that there's like one drop and it's like the tier three and it's just so outclassed yeah we could get like six or seven total ranks of a weapon from what i recall and it's like if this is as high as it gets from normal find it feels pretty bad also i could have been dropping i guess une technically on uh mr fireface Do I really want to go back and save another Une? Not really. Alright, so we're going to walk in here without equipping Mina's Talisman. We're going to get the other ending real quick. That should unlock more things for us. So in the randomizers, this will end up having a double door to warn you not to come in here. Instead, you might be playing the game and just happen to do this, think it gets a normal fight. Huh? Mina! Soma! Soma Cruz, hold the last moments of your loved one's life. Wait! Stop! So Soma Goodbye, Soma. Goodbye, Mina. Mina! You! Here we go, we're letting the devil take over. You heartless wench! Certainly wasn't easy spiriting her away. Go ahead, hate me. Hate me as much... Hate me so much that you want to kill me. You... You'll pay for this! I like that even in, like... Okay, let's say her plan works and she gets the Dark Lord. Doesn't she still die? Like, huh, I made him hate me and he became the Dark Lord. Therefore, I'm the victor. Oh, wait, I die. Bleh. <laughs> right, chat? Like, uh. Chaos is manifesting. I was right. Now hate me more. Loathe me. When your hatred peaks, the new Dark Lord shall emerge. 
It means getting Mina's revenge. Then so be it. I'll become your Dark Lord. Mina, forgive me. I can't keep my promise. It's coming. The birth of the new Dark Lord. Ah! Right? Like, 10 out of 10, she thought that through. Then she goes, why? Like, what did she think was gonna happen, chat? Why? I brought you back into this world. Shut up, you annoy me. That's all the reason I need. Besides, the petty little humans will die off soon enough. Your turn came a little earlier, that's all. <laughs> so, Soma has become the Dark Lord. I have no other choice. The battles of the past are to be waged once again. Might be because I'm Brazilian, the name Soma Cruz is so dumb. It doesn't really mean anything in English, to my knowledge, so for me, I don't, I don't feel any way towards it. I'd assume that he would have equipped the amulet from Mina. I love the game actively chastising you. This is so rude, chat. Look at this BS sass you get from Ericado. It would have protected him, but alas, I will have to unleash my power. The sass is real. Julius mode has been unlocked. Data has been saved. Oh, it saved our data again. Nice. <laughs> Scroll. We... This time with another Ude. There we go, chat. Right thumb stick movements. Oh, look. He's in the evil Soma phase, aka Dracula. Translates to Edition Cross in Portuguese. Interesting. I was gonna say, isn't Soma the name of the drug in Brave New World? It's been a while since I read that. That's what I think of whenever I hear his name. Okay, I can skip it. I was just curious. We, we saw the credits already. Might as well proceed further. Chad, if only we had been more careful. Anyway, I'm gonna put on wherever it is. Mina's Talisman. Get the temporary nerf. Just remember, chat. Mina's Talisman will protect you from becoming the devil, but it's otherwise worthless. Satan's ring is much better. Or Tears of Blood, as we learned earlier. Oh, didn't want to get poisoned. I, I'm actually so happy that dive kick worked. I was like, oh no, please don't poison me. It's going to be so annoying to deal with. Okay, so we'll get to the new part of the cutscene, I guess. So, yada yada, her finger points, death beam to Mina. So, so Shout Mina, then you. Heartless wedge. Ah, right, there we go. Now something should happen here. We start absorbing souls, but... Wait. Oh, there we go. Wow, it goes really late in the cutscene. Soma, don't be fooled! <laughs> I love Mina's talisman is just summoning Ericado. Like, it doesn't actually stop us from absorbing the souls. So I'm not actually convinced it does anything. <laughs> just, just it summons Aracado quicker, aka Alucard. 
Amina is a fake. Ericado, why must you always get in the way? How clever of you to use a doppelganger. Ah, but you haven't won just yet. Ugh! What? What's wrong? There we go, chant. The big plot twist. It was never Mina. Dimitri, I should thank my lucky stars for making good my escape. I managed to loosen myself when the boy's emotions shifted momentarily. I thought you died. Shedding my former body was a desperate gamble. This worked out quite well. You copied the power of dominance from Soma? Ah, oh, so you understand. He's so smug, Chad. Look how happy he is. I touched the boy's soul and copied his ability. I've been double, doubly lucky in finding a suitable replacement for my body. You obtained the same power as Soma Cruz? When I fought the boy, I confirmed one thing. Dracula's era need not be the inheritor of all the Dark Lord's powers. I only need to possess the power of dominance to become the true Dark Lord's heir. And of course, only I could gain that ability. <laughs> I love how he says only I, but in the other ending, he just becomes consumed. I touched the boy's soul, a certainly sentence. Welcome, Chris. I won't allow that. Have patience, Ericardo. Perhaps I should address you with your real name. When the boy began his dark transformation. Scan memories of his past lives. Make one move and the boy will die. You don't wish that, do you? Hmm. Does becoming the Dark Lord really mean that much to you? I have told you before. You should learn what my power signifies. Celia, you must gain dominance over more powerful demons. I will surpass the boy. So be it. She's also kind of smug. So, Cruz, take back what I have said to you. It seems that your death is... It seems that death is your only destiny. I like, I like that we just let them talk and get away for like the fifth time. Whatever could Ericado's real name be, it's such a mystery. It could be anything. It could even be Ericado. Ericado, where do you think they've gone? I imagine they've gone to the basement of the tower next to the castle. A foul one of three energy emanates from there. There must be a portal to the darkness that fills the castle's existence. I see. Don't do anything rash. Not any shape to fight now. Let us handle this. He took this power from me. I must be the one to stop him. Dot dot dot. Fine. But Julius and I will go in first. Conveniently off screen. Bye. We'll explore that little that little room space just for chat. I didn't have to walk that way. But I did it for chat. I'm so happy that dive kick worked. So sadly, I don't think we got the thing that upgraded the katana at any point. Like, I could fight and upgrade it more. Oh, also, we need to uh, make sure Satan's ring is on. Need as much help as we could get with damage with the katana. Um, I forget where the mirror was. I think it's like directly below us. I'm. I'll pick up this item. We skip most of the mirror items because tier of blood is just straight up better. The only exception is this upcoming item might be worth picking up, because it is just basically pure damage, which is all that matters with the katana. I'm gonna go on a small detour. Yeah, I think we had to get a soul from this room. I remember I was trying to remember where this area was. Post stream, I remembered. Because there's like that uh, diagonal diving demon, this thing. So I could farm this thing for the uh, upgrade. I don't feel like it, but we do need that technically for one of our upgrades. Okay, let's go further down. I think it might be to the right once we get down here. Oh yeah, I don't think we ever got guillotine or 
did we? I mean, not that it matters because we have Mandragora. Oh, we do have Guillotine Earth. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. We have Mandragora. I might want to equip it just to save MP, but it is kind of awkward. Wow, that one shot is real. Well, I guess we get one more chance at an upgrade. Actually, two chances, because I gotta leave this room. Wait, this goes somewhere? Where does this go? Oh, it leads over here. Oh, that's hilarious. We didn't, we didn't even go here. <laughs> like, that whole area chat, irrelevant. We don't, we don't need to go over there. That answers that question, I guess. One more chance and an upgrade. Nope. I like our one shot, though. That was cute. Sadly, we don't kill the guillotine in one hit. And I'll take the damage boost. Listen. There we go. I knew it was down here somewhere. I remembered something, chat. Despite us having like a two week break, I did it. Oh, excuse me, it's Meng Mengiord. I, I knew it was an M something. But anyway, if you take a look at this, it is really high in damage, which we probably want with the katana for rapid cancel purposes. Oh, oops. Take my controller unplugged. Did not like that. I'm gonna say, don't scare me, game. So we can technically do more damage with this. So it has one purpose. I don't think I need Paranoia anymore, because I don't think the other items are worth picking up. Um... Honestly? I don't think I even care about a Goonie. Slaughter is decent, but we lost our opportunity to use it. We needed to use it before we got into the Oops All Flying bosses. So this does cost 30, which kind of sucks, but it's fun. Okay, chat, one last opportunity for an upgrade before we leave here. I'm pretty sure the RNG has forsaken us. Oh, I bonked my head. Oh well, an attempt was made, chat. Yeah. No upgrade for us. Which is more than I did the first time we played. <laughs> right, chat? I, there is at least a vague attempt to get the soul. Oh, rotten meat is good because we have the uh we actually have the ghoul soul so we can actually use that for healing yeah we went from doing i think 52 to 57 damage a hit pretty significant might lead to some one shots so this weapon is rel or that accessory is relevant if i want to do katana damage i don't think it's necessary for the big sword because it already has so much damage i'd rather just have in the way i could just kind of be good at everything Okay, so we're gonna go to the tower that I never bothered to complete. Remember the tower I didn't complete, chat? So Gurgoth lives in our playthrough. I forget if we need Dragonizo for any crafting. Maybe later down the line, but for our playthrough it doesn't matter. We already got the Super Sword, which is all we need. We're gonna be spamming it with basically ints up. We should be good. Break this barrier. It's definitely possible. There's no guarantee that I'll have any, any... Excuse me. But there's no guarantee that I'll have any energy left to fight. Without your power, it's impossible for us to get through. They have to be stopped at all costs. At least that's our thoughts. Well, desperate times call for desperate measures. Fine, stand back. 
Here goes. There you go, Chad. Grand Cross. Ah! Ugh, the barrier, it's gone. We're indebted to you, Julius. Go already, there's no time for chit-chat. Right. Soma, going old is a horrible thing. You're like in your 30s, get over yourself. Just relax, don't worry, we'll take it from here. All right, I'm counting on you. Don't let me down, kid. So I still have a lot of healing from earlier, and we have Tasty Meat. So I don't think I'm going to go back and get more healing. We should be good. And keep in mind, I have things to convert the rotten items into healing. I think I'm just going to go for the end of the game here. So fortunately, the only thing we need to win is MP once we beat this next boss. So the fact that I have nine of these and two prisms and three mind ups, I think it'll be fine. Oh boy, chat. Welcome to the level that I don't remember how to progress. I need to go downwards. But where we go downwards is a mystery to me. Oh, that is the most convenient save room. I could not even state to you how lucky it is that I found this. I would not like to do this walk again. Thank you. Okay. Oh. I unfortunately did not have that. I cannot wait until we get the uppercut move. <laughs> I forget if we skipped it, to be honest. It's possible we skipped it. Which is fine. I don't need it to beat the game, but man oh man, would sky uppercutting save some time? Oh. Hey, cameo boss. Well, we're going to play Pick a Path chat, my favorite part of Castlevania. I would like to not use any healing though, so we'll just go back here. I guess it's this path downwards. Hmm. I feel like so far gray has never been the right answer, so maybe I can ignore these. Just look for this. I mean, it seems to be working so far. <laughs> right, Chad? I'm just kind of going, wee. Like, there's no rhyme or reason for what I'm doing. I'm just kind of zigzagging. There's the other boss cameo. Hmm. It's another save. What is this room? Oh, it's a warp? Oh, man, thank you. <laughs> right, chat? Wait a minute. Wait a minute, that's actually huge. Cool. I'm gonna just go save up here. So the reason why this is big is because I'm gonna be coming back at some point and I would like to not have to climb the mine shaft. I would like to have a shortcut out of here. So I'm gonna save my progress. So I forget if there's a save near death or not. But either way, that was fortuitous. But we'll keep going downwards. And believe it or not, we're almost done with the game. We have three bosses to go. One of which being death. Yeah, I think the strength up on this weapon will help significantly with the upcoming fight. I could technically double with the strength increase and really kill the boss. But it is very risky due to how often the boss hits. If I mess something up. Yeah, 
Now, I don't know if there's any items down there. I don't feel like finding out. I don't think it matters. No matter what it is, we have basically the best accessories. Oh, this might actually be a save. Right, so there was a save here. Makes sense. Hi, right, chat. I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't remember what Depp does. I know he swings his scythe at us, and I have to play dodge the mini scythes. I don't remember anything about his attack pattern, so this will be fun. <laughs> it's the boss I fight the least outside of the final boss. And technically, I fought the final boss more than death because I remember doing this without souls. Yeah, so let's learn. We're gonna learn in real time what this boss does. So I think, first things first, we swap to the big axe. Okay, we could, we could slide under those. Good to know. Okay, Scythe doesn't hit me if I'm crossing its graphic, which is good. Probably could have gotten a little closer for a better punish. Okay. And this isn't too bad so far. We're learning currently. Would like to put double on soon though. I'm more worried about his other attacks. I know he has different ones. Maybe we have to earn it. Is that the wrong way? I think it's one of those things I have to be facing the correct way. Like, he can't... Oh, that... Yeah, okay. He takes a little bit to go in between. Bird. There we go. So, so far, pretty simple. But I think he has another phase. Because he hasn't chucked his scythe at us. That's the phase I don't know what to do. Oh, as well as just pop this, because he's taken so long. Damn, he went to the other phase immediately. The one that I don't know. Okay, duck. Uh -huh. Oh, I don't have that. That's annoying. Or is, is bad on this one? And yeah, I don't have that. So annoying. Anyway, we're just gonna brute force it. That's... that's evil. That placement of the scythe there, chat, that was actually evil. Did you like that? I went to get out of it and it was like, no, deal with it. Ah, oh, that wasn't too bad. So I used a couple healing potions, but I don't think it really matters. Y, L, B, X, A, B... R B Y X R B A Y. Jeez, what a ridiculous symbol. Some of the Grim Reaper like to attack enemies. There we go. We got to see the boss patterns briefly, I guess. I am going to go save our progress. So how many healing items do I have for the final boss? Seven potions, I still have a rice ball, we have tasty meat, which is a lot of healing, mushrooms, corn soup, teas, coffee, so we got a, we got a good range. So no reason to go back to the shop, but I will save. Realistically, I only need like three or four healing items for the final boss, like, to basically heal myself to full one and a half times. I think that's about all the safety that I need, especially if I want to double, but honestly, I might not even double. I think I'm just gonna cheese the final boss. <laughs> like honestly, chat, we we did it without getting any souls last time. We just fought with the locust swarm or whatever it's called. Hmm. Oh, I forgot there was a save here. Sure, I'll save here. I was like, wait a minute, there's a room to the left. I don't see people go in this room normally. That is incredibly rude. I can see why people don't go to this area first, because it makes you misalign with the pillar timing. That kind of sucks. 
Hi, we need to unequip double. This is very annoying. Also, chat, I would have loved if there was just a dedicated bat button so that I could still keep my passives but still fly. Just saying. I would have loved that. Seriously. Whatever. Let's just go through. Hmm. This is going to be quite the hallway. Unfortunately, though, with Mandragora. That works. Not my favorite damage boost, as that's probably going to require me to heal. we leveled. Oh, I just remembered. I need to go down here if I want the other thing that I was talking about earlier. <laughs> right, chat? Like, wow. They needed this way earlier in the game. get free souls, so I might as well just kill these on the way through. I got nothing better to do with my MP. Right, chat? Might as well just check them. Oh, this is gonna be a room. Sadly. No, thank you. Right, chat? No thanks. Oh, this is the other thing we need to kill for uh, upgrades, which we got earlier. Which we just picked up! Huh. Interesting. Well,. That would have been more useful before we got here, because I'm not going back at this point. Thank you, Madragora. You really are the thing that solves everything. I don't want to deal with that. I'm out of MP, though, sadly. I'm actually going to use a couple of uh, mind-ups. I mean, anything to make my journey here a little faster, or at least a little more clean. I don't want to pick it up. Get some of our MP back. Did not get the thing I was looking for. Hmm. Hold on, chat. We're... I want to see if I can manipulate his movements. Kind of. Took damage, though, which is not great. Wow, that actually one-shots? That's crazy. Come on, give it to us. Come on. Do it. Do it. <laughs> I want the soul chat. 
I'm willing to burn a lot of MP for this. Come on, give it to us. It'll be so sad if I level up before I get it. Alright, we're gonna go until I level or I get the soul. They see at least easy enough to maneuver into this attack. I wonder if I could use Guillotina instead. That way I don't use as much MP. A little less. Yeah, there we go, chat. Welcome to the most broken soul in the game. Other than Devil, of course. So... Not that expensive, and we're going to be replacing all of our red souls with this ability. Oops, where is it at? It's a big AoE that swats away those annoying drones on the final boss. It's also cheaper than the Magic Aura by, I think, 10 MP. So, yeah, we now don't really care about it, MP. Guillotiner, next time find some nobles. Yeah, there we go, chat. We use Guillotiner. To give you an idea, that did 186 without any int boosts. If we had int boosts, I think it would have broken 200 plus. Is this a save room? Oh, it is. Oh, okay. It doesn't really matter. We, we got the best soul of the game. It does not matter anymore what we do from here on out. I think what we could also do is you could dash cancel it repeatedly. And you could also do it while... Yeah, you could also just kind of... You do that. <laughs> kind of funny. Alright, let's hopefully get some good luck here. See what happens. Alright, we did not get Aranus, sadly. Yeah, that damage is like super stupid high. And it lingers forever and it hits in all like all directions. Okay, I'm gonna hope he stays near a corner and does not do the U attack repeatedly. Wow. Alright, well. Did not get my hopes and dreams here. It's like one. Oh, what a jerk. Alright, so I need to swap to bat to fly, which is kind of annoying. I'm just not used to weapon swapping mid fight. It's kind of like my weapons. Alright, this is good. Oh, this that's bad. I might be able to do that with just a dive kick. No. Unfortunate. Also, that could just randomly hit me multiple times. Alright, so we got kind of unlucky. I can't do my dash cancels because he's just supporting on the corner for some reason. The jerk. Seriously? Seriously? I'm getting trolled right now, chat. Why is he- why is he only in the corner? Oh, I might die from that. Uh... I'm super dead? Unless I potion. Wow. Yeah, this is what I wanted to be doing, Cat, but uh, he said no to that real quick. What a jerk. Yeah, him going in the corner is the worst possible position he could be in. One, because he could potentially cut off safe passages. And we've seen before, sometimes he gets confused. If you remember the last time we played this, he actually did his commands in reverse for some reason. 
So go check out that clip chat where he did all of his inputs, but the wrong way. So the safe zone was where he was standing and there was no safe zone. Holy, hopefully we finish here. Otherwise I'll just redo the boss. This, this is one of my least favorite fights in the game. There's so much RNG. Uh... There we go. Barely did that in time looking at the inputs. We did level though. Yeah, and I think a lot of it is just awkwardness because you have to like form swap and then bat repeatedly. But then if you do that, you can't devil. Kind of sucks. We get a bat in, which is decent. It's very expensive. We used this before to beat the other boss. We just do that. Like, it'll eventually kill. Or you can just. So, anyway, we have enough healing to beat the game. I'm not that worried. This boss is going to use the majority of the healing. The one that we just fought. I have some backup potions, so I have enough to full heal a little bit. Tasty meats, we have like near infinite MP. So I mostly just don't really want to devil. I just want to spam things like Malakota. Slap these things from existence. We're also at the point where I think I would rather have the defense. Though honestly, it's not that big of a difference. It does give me more int. Uh, it's fun. We'll switch to Big Sword for the, the boss itself. Look at that damage chat. Actually stupid damage. We did not get Panther. That is so sad. slightly too slow. So it's allegedly a 1 in 8 chance. We'll see though. I would like to get Black Panther before we go any further. So I would like to go back to the castle later. Early. Did it the wrong way. If I had my back turn that would have killed. Or not. Actually it takes a while to come out. What? Where's the hitbox of Malakota? There we go. <laughs> I guess it has to be swinging to do damage, because it definitely passed through the graphic. Unfortunate. Chat. We are not getting lucky with Black Panther. This sucks. I don't need to heal, but it would be nice if we got it soon. At the same time, I think the annoying part is that this demon is here. I'm not worried about the damage the Panther does. It could do 12 to us all at once. I don't really care. Got it. That's painful. So sad, chat. Come on. It's the only thing stopping me from beating the game, by the way, chat. I want this because I need to show off the castle later. If I didn't have to show off something at the castle later, I would not bother with this. So unfair. So we're at five. So far, still don't see it. Six. We're, we're going into I'm being very unlucky territory. You know what? I actually need more aerial height with this. I'm actually going to put on... Aura. 
They're in like just an annoying enough position that I do want to do this. Yeah, there we go. Mandragora hits both. That's what I had a feeling about too. Alright, we're gonna lose some MP, but the farm is not going well, so I might as well just burn it. I just need to stand a little further forward to use less MP. So I think we are now officially not seen one in eight kills. Thanks, RNG. Cat knows I just love RNG. It's my favorite. There we go. <laughs> Complain. Complain and we eventually get it. Like, it's very fast. some weird air tech. Yeah. We're almost done with the game, fortunately. I just gotta get through this horrible hallway. Oh, you actually summon other things. That's unfortunate. prism out of that though. That means I can use a mind up to get further. I'd like to not burn too much more healing. I'm starting to get to a point where I am concerned due to tanking hits earlier. Right, we just gotta get through one more set of rooms and then we're done. There's a Black Panther there. Oh well. I'm hitting him through the floor. Listen, chat. I don't want to take any more chip damage. We're just gonna do what we need to do to get to the end. If that shell hurt me, I would have been so tilted, Chad. You have no idea. Dealing with that, no thank you. <sighs> Just self screen. There we go. I had a feeling we could kill her from there. Oh, we actually got a soul. White dragon breathe fire. Okay, we just need we just need to get to the end and we're good. We have more than enough healing for the final boss. There's a warp in case I want to go buy healing. Um no. But I would like to save. <laughs> right, chat? What was that interaction? Wait, can he not stand on that platform? What happened there? What? How did I get stuck in the crouching animation? That was very weird. By the way, Chad, I was not holding down on the D-pad there, just for clarity. He just, he just, left, right, didn't do anything. I guess he got confused in bat form because I, like, I untransformed. The game didn't know what to do. Very weird. It was very special. This one is special. So our int is 56, which is pretty good. I actually don't care about our melee damage at all. So I could put on a neck warmer. I really wanted to tank it up, but I don't think I do. So yeah, this thing gives us int, so I might as well just use everything we need with this. Contemplating if it's worth... Oh, that's right. This is the one where I have to use it and then you gain it. Oh. No, that's not worth it. I thought we got another passive thing that boosted in. We got rid of it before. I think it was Lilith had it. 
I would have actually equipped Lilith at this point if we still had it. Oh well. Such is life, I guess. Bonk. So we're a sweet level 41, so I think we're technically about the level we should beat the boss. We have 600 health, which is pretty good. We have Mandragora, we have Malakota. All I gotta do is land some hits. Okay, this, I wouldn't I couldn't remember if there's a save here. I probably should have checked. But anyway. We have enough that at least I can make it to the warp. In case there's enemies here or something weird happens. Yeah, we should be at the final room now. Good, good, good. We have Golem. We got Golem and there's basically no point to switching unless we want to use Ghoul. So we have a few super heals with Rotten Meat. Because I think Rotten Meat is a full health heal, I think, with Ghoul. But even if it's just 100, it's more than I think we need. But basically, we just need MP. Zoma, what happened? He arrived too late, quite simply. He managed to dominate a terrible demon. I tried to prevent the summoning ritual from happening, but... No dark power failed to overcome the power I gained from the sacrifice. What sacrifice? Yeah, if we become a ghoul, we can eat the rotten meat. Celia! Such an unseemly sight. Be gone! Yeah, so we have more healing than it looks like. You killed your own ally? Yeah, that's how you prove you're evil. She'd always dreamed of seeing the Dark Lord. She served me to the end in my becoming. She should feel honored. Not only that, she even helped me take care of that pesky Aracado. Huh? Yeah, cool boss fight not to be seen. He's right. The sacrifice reversed the flow of my powers. This stage is now set. We shall see who will dominate whom. What? This cannot be. My dominance should be complete. Well, that's what's happening. Ericardo, what's going on? The power of dominance isn't easily contained. Dimitri isn't like you. The soul can't withstand a power that intense. Liar! I've had enough from you! Whoa! Ericardo! I am the chosen one! I am the Dark Lord! I shall not succumb to the power! Whoa! It's useless. You can't control it. Oh, the, ooh, that's that's also quite a face. <laughs> Just look at that chat. Grar, indeed. So he's doing well. Ah! The demons under his dominance, they fused as one. Letting this out would be a disaster. It must end here. I mean, that also does good damage, but I'm on Malakota. I mean, if he never aims where I'm at, I'm okay with that. <laughs> My chat, like, I'm totally okay with that. Listen. so far away. It's like using Demon, but I don't even have to lose health. It's like actually insane how stupid this ability is. Yeah, like, did <laughs> you see that? Just slapped him repeatedly. Do you know what I mean, chat? Like, this is why I just need MP. Listen. <laughs> I think we're good. I just gotta climb up. got stuck in the animation. I forgot I could dash cancel that. Anyway, as I said before, this is good for just smacking the helmet and also any other flyers that could be around. And it's so strong that it will generally one-shot if I have the right buffs on. But sadly... Wait a minute, am I on the wrong... No, I'm on the right one. Okay, I just want to make sure. Oops. Not me to cancel that.
Although, I am land canceling it, which is not what I quite want to do with it. There we go. Anyway, back to our regularly scheduled spam. Alright, so if I turn my back, it seems more efficient at dealing with him, funny enough. Though if I... Oh, wasn't expecting him to actually reach me there. He'll be done in a little bit, fortunately. I could also summon Locust if I don't feel like aiming at all. Which, given how much this boss is moving... I feel like it's a lot. I feel like this boss just did not move this much the last time we fought him, but whatever. It's fine. I got a little injured, that's fine. There we go. Rarity, he's half dead already. <sighs> really? We're gonna do this? You know... Right, chat? You know, now now he's just doing the stompies over and over. Could you not? I'd appreciate it if you didn't do the stompies. He hit me with the foot. Oh, that took a lot of damage there. I gotta be careful. Oh, can you please stop doing the stompies? Could you actually come over the platforms where I could hit you repeatedly? Just ridiculous, chat. I'm getting trolled. I just want you to know. Please come over here. No. You're just gonna stay on the right side where there's no platforms? I can't jump strike you repeatedly? On the plus side. I guess I could save some MP by doing that. Alright, he's actually far back enough I can use the platform if I want to now, but he's almost dead, so whatever. What a troll. Yeah, this is what I want him to do, not this stupid stomp nonsense. Yeah, there we go, GG. What a troll. Just, he just kept kicking at me, I'm like, just let me hit you. Jerk. So yeah, we did not use that much healing in the end. We got like one life bar restored. Which is about... That makes sense. I mean, we would take like 300 something from the biter, so whatever. We're like, I... Stop! There you go, Chan. Goodbye, souls. What are you doing? This place won't hold. We have to get out. I love my Steam achievements will make no sense for people that like look at them later. It'll be like, wait, how did you beat the game and then you went back and fought Rahab? <laughs> how, how does that work? It's finally over. We're finished here. Let's go. No, we got three more bosses to go. Then we'll say we're done. Soma dot dot dots. Soma, what's wrong? Tell me, just what does it mean to be the Dark Lord? What Celia told you wasn't necessarily wrong. The Dark Lord is the entity opposite to God. And that means there will always be a need for a Dark Lord. All because I ducked out from becoming the next in line. Don't misconstrue me. Perhaps there must be a Dark Lord. But there's no reason at all for you to become that Dark Lord. But if it weren't for me, none of this would have happened. You're neither a god nor a demon. You're only human. You have no chance at ever achieving perfection. Damn, we just got told. Or are you saying you want to be... You want to be the Dark Lord? No, of course not. Then stay true to that. Look. There are people waiting for you. Don't break their hearts. Everyone. You kept your promise. Welcome back, Soma. Looks like you're all done. Your face says it all. Ericado, you're right. 
Mina, what are you doing here? Of course I came here. I was so worried. Oh, Mina, I'm sorry. Don't cry. Gotcha. Welcome back, Soma. Poor Soma. Shall you wrapped around her finger? Oh, without a doubt. I'd like to be wrapped around Yoko's finger. Oh, shut up, Hammer. What are you saying? Mina and I, we're not... <laughs> That's right. No need to be bashful, you two. The world needs a Dark Lord. It will emerge, even if it's not you, Soma. <laughs> yeah, please cut to credits. Boss Rush mode has been unlocked. Sound mode has been unlocked. It has been saved. Oh, that means I've probably lost all my healing items. That sucks. Anyway, let's, um, I guess, continue the game. Somehow we cleared 89% of the map, which to me is hilarious given how much I skipped in the game. <laughs> right, chat? Like, like, keep in mind, like, oops. <laughs> like, like, you can just see the gaps where I just didn't come back. Um, I guess I'll go to the shop since we're going to be fighting some bosses. What would be the wrong order to do the bosses that I skipped, chat? I guess I leave Puppet Master for last. Wait, this is not the right... I'll kill you, though, since I'm here. I guess I go Rahab... Or is it Gurgoth Rahab? What would be the true worst order to do? I imagine I do Rahab first. Well... I don't... I, I've never done it legitimately, so I actually don't remember the intended order. Like, you get swimming, but I forget what swimming is allegedly supposed to unlock for you. And I know Puppet Master we were supposed to get way long ago, which is really funny. No, I don't ever wonder how Mina's doing, Hammer. I don't want to see her. Shaking my head. Alright, so I have like a million mind ups if I really need them. I think I got basically everything else in here that I'm interested in. I could, in theory, raise money for the Soul Eater Ring if I was gonna 100% the game, since that still affects the Soul Drop Rate. But, uh, spoilers, we're not 100%ing this game. <laughs> right, Chad? Just no. I would have liked to have gotten the Succubus, but yet again, it eludes us. Um... Is there really not a closer warp to do this? This sucks. Okay, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna go to the bottom left first, then we're gonna do Gurgoth and Rahab, and then we'll go fight Puppet Master last. Which should be very funny with Malakota. <laughs> I should be able to basically just dunk on these enemies. So we have absolutely endgame items, so we should be two-shotting most things, if not one-shotting. Oh, we actually did one shot. What a shame. I like that we got Pro Cell Soul on the first try. Our only first try soul, aside from bosses, which don't count because that's guaranteed. I do love the water physics in this game. When you dive kick into the water, you just go flying. As long as the water's deep enough. Oh, this enemy chat. Gross. I love that I can also just dive kick those. That to me is hilarious. She built up this like massive slow attack and you're just like, boop. Speaking of which, I don't need Devil. Let's go to Panther, wherever the heck it is in this list. Why am I not seeing it? Oh, there it is. There we go. Okay. So, oh, can I not 
throw. I didn't think about this. Oh, I don't think I could throw. Never mind. We shouldn't have done this first. But on the plus side, I could showcase weird air movement attack, I guess. Just stay up at the ceiling forever. My bad, I forgot. <laughs> I actually dodged the Uka Vexel. That's kind of funny. Never mind. We'll come here once I get, uh, we'll, we'll do this last, actually, because I could show off all the options once I get, uh, both Puppet Master and Rahab. And we also have Bone Arc, so we could show off that method as well. Uh, nothing worth killing up here, unless I just want to kill Devil again. Yeah, we needed something that makes us not flinch when we take damage. That would have been huge. Because otherwise we just kind of bump into stuff like that and lose our Panther. I guess I'll go fight Gurgoth now. I think it would be Gurgoth, Tower... End of game. As I said before, I don't know what the intended use is. Because this just gives you a key to access tower, so I think this has to be the last in the chain. At least we can cruise through real quick. Right, chat? We... Oh, we could have gotten disc armor stuff. I remember. Oh, <laughs> that still hit me. Ridiculous. What a ridiculous character. I say, isn't there a healing item up here or something? In another room. I know there's big axe at some point. There it is. Sadly, we did not get his draw. I don't need Bat Company at all for this fight, so I could just leave it on Black Panther on both. So that's the key I would normally do in order to progress to the end of the game. So that's why I was thinking this is probably first. If we're doing the wrong boss order. He actually survives a Malakota strike. I'm actually impressed by that, right, chat? Wait a minute. Something doesn't die to this instantly. It's more shocking to me than anything else. Also, they give almost as much XP as the underground enemies, really? Huh. I guess because they are quite tanky. Do something like this. Try to get his soul, but I don't think it's gonna happen, sadly. Yeah, I don't think this is happening. Oh well. Tried. It is the biggest axe. I don't even care about it for like a damaging soul, I just want it for crafting. Anyway, we're now level 41, we got more experience. I'm probably gonna hit 42. Oh no! No, not another seal! <laughs> Wait, which suit was it three? Oh, hold on, chat. I gotta write. Hold on, I have to write this down. It's why seal. I'm gonna write seal three so I don't re misremember which one it is when I'm looking at all these ridiculous seals. Alright, so seal four is this. Seal three is. I already didn't remember. It started with Y. Where, where did it go from here? Y, A, B. Y, A, B, Y? Really? Y. Yeah, so we like to keep practicing. Y, A, B, Y, X, B. Oh, that's not too bad. 
I could probably, like, actually remember that versus draw it repeatedly. Um... I mean, I guess I could double this fight. Not really worried about losing. There we go. Look at that 320 damage chat. That was fun. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. Y, A, B, Y, X, D. There we go. Poor Gurgoth. Ah. I purposely drained my health just to be at 404. I did it, chat. That was my own mini game. Gurgoth laser acquired. Imagine climbing all the way back up the way the game intended you to climb up, right chat? Could you imagine? Oh, there was a Discarmor up here. Oh, that's what I was remembering. Is I gonna say that I felt like there's another piece of equipment somewhere. Not that it matters at all. So anyway, this is now much easier. Look at this chat. Yeah, we're not double jumping across the gap or whatever the heck it wants us to do normally. No thank you. <laughs> right, chat? No. <laughs> That's nice. We actually got to use the flight ability, which we definitely should have gotten in the Gurgoth fight. I'm just saying, it would have made sense. Right? Like, you get the soul, and then you get to fly all the way back up there. So that's taken care of. Um... I guess I could try to show off the bonus in the, uh, tower. There we go, chat. The only purpose of the key, by the way, is this one door. That's all it opens. So remember that cutscene? We came in in the wrong way. This is how we were supposed to reach that cutscene. Also, I want this one to be, uh, bad. This one to be Panther. On the plus side, I could skip that puzzle now. <laughs> right, chat? Like, little... Ooh, that was really bad. Um... Sure. What the heck is this? <laughs> right, chat? Just... Just waste the time. That was unlucky. Did I really uppercut straight into the spawning enemy? Sucks. Oh, right. There was a mirror here. I totally forgot about this mirror. I'm not gonna lie. But since I'm here, I might as well as check it. Right, chat? Could have had platinum stud. gives me more defense and intelligence than the strength does, but I think it's just worse. So I could have gone on a big exploration thing, or I could have just gone to the other boss and gotten Satan Ring. So that's kind of the problem with some of these items. They're just not good or worth the time to find. 
Like, they would have been amazing if they weren't mirror-locked and I got this at the time that I entered the tower. It would have actually been useful. Ouch. Speaking of which, I'm at the room that I wanted to, uh, to basically reach. Did he seriously untransform and put his hitbox higher so I got hit by the spikes? Are you kidding me? On a sorrow, please. Okay, I'm gonna put his butt on the floor. There we go, Chad. Konami man. We have acquired Konami man. We did it. That's the only reason I came over here, by the way, Chad. I just want to be very clear. That's that's literally it. We, we saw it. We did it. We're just catching things I didn't get. You know, there was a bedroom in the other place. I forget which bedroom it was in the ghost hall. Guess we could go get that since we're kind of just cleaning things up. Um... room was it in? I don't remember. Well, let's find out. If chat knows which room it is, by all means spoil it. We have to sit in a chair at a room. One of these things we could just get a very easy pickup. We could also go back to the room with the bells in it, which I d also don't super remember where that is offhand. We could get the final collectible. Oh, she dropped his coffee. How nice of her. Oh. <laughs> there's there's Puppet Master that we didn't fight. Right, chat? Shh, don't tell the game. <laughs> Just... We're like, oh, honest. Yeah, oh, yeah, we'll, we'll fight Puppet Master at some point. I swear. At least it's pretty easy to get the Puppet Master. I would actually like to get the Lilith Soul back. We'll see if it happens. Got cursed. No. All right, chat. No. Uh, no more speedies. No speedy fun times while cursed. Lucky this glitch. No. Not lucky enough, chat. That would have made me happy. Must be on the lower floors. Watch magic does the track target. Nice. Alright, we tried one more time to get the succubus thing to show it off, but if it doesn't happen, it doesn't happen. You saw we killed like at least 20 succubus. There just comes a hard limit where you just don't care anymore. Ah, this room. There we go, we found it. There should be one more. Where was the bell room? Hmm. It was near the tower entrance. It might just be over here. It might literally be right here. That's why I'm just I'm checking real quick since we're here. Is this the room with the bells? No. Ball. 
Game, game, stop. Stop spawning imps when I'm uppercutting. That is so horrible. Getting trolled. They're very rude spawns. 573, not worth doing. If I had Succubus Glitch, I would do it. Hmm. Speed lower. Where was the bell room if not there? Because it's a vertical room. I could always look it up, I guess. But anyway, let's go save. Let's go find the fish. I think the problem is that like most maps won't have that unless it's like a full item clear. Do you know what I mean? So it doesn't help to just have like the names of the areas. I need like specifically it to be the thing that tells me where the item is. Hmm. Oh yeah, I forgot there were weapon specials in this game. They're so irrelevant. I'm gonna be honest with you. Like, you use them in, like, maybe the very, very beginning of the game, and that's it. So we got the rare ring before. Went up here. Rahab is in between these two points. Hmm. Oh, you know what? I think I know where it is. It's in a place I don't like to go to. It is close to the tower, but not in the way that I think I was thinking. Gotta go this way. I feel like when you want a panther, but you forget that both of them aren't set to panther. Right, let's clear this up real quick. Yeah, should be over here. We'll get our final bonus game, please. We'll get our final Castlevania item. Yeah, here it is. Technically, I could get a mana prism if I want to. It's not this one. There we go. We got the bell. Oh, those are the bonus items. I guess it's technically possible to go down from here. I might as well just try. Ooh, I just barely, I barely stopped myself to get that Valkyrie soul chat. That was a great restraint I held left. Go pick that up. That one's a fun soul. Too bad we got it way too late in the game for it to matter. Exactly. Exactly. your soul? No. God. We're gonna go back the way before where I was wondering where the path would go, because I think that's actually where the boss is. Do that. Oops. Game did not like that. Oh, I found the boss door. That answers that question. Is this a save? It is. So what was the intent? Oh, this was to get bad. Oh, right. So we wouldn't normally have bad at this point. 
Wow, we did this so out of order, chat. I love our I love our playthrough. We just did not care. <laughs> just <laughs> right, chat. We just we just did not care. Not even in the slightest what the correct order was. <gasps> oh, okay. I got scared. I was like, where where's my other abilities? Um. I don't know if Malakota actually hits the boss consistently. I could drop cats on them in theory. Oops. Yeah, for some reason it keeps cutting off the bottom of chat. I was trying to read chat, but it just will not let me see it. Yeah, it doesn't hit the bottom. Might be here a while, chat. I don't- I didn't get the, uh, soccer soul, sadly. This is gonna take a while. I can do that, though. Yeah, is this up before? Castlevania was very temperamental in trying to capture it. So it could be very finicky when I switch between scenes. At least I could do that for extra damage. do this so I can see chat again. Yeah, I don't have Yorick. I do have Bat, though, which doesn't really help me. Yeah, so I can do dive kicks to technically hit him with the other abilities. I'm at the point where I'm just gonna use Devil. This fight takes way too long to do normally. Yeah, sucks when you don't have the right souls. Oh, I've had enough. What? Did you eat an input game? I did not input that incorrectly. I think I got trolled by the game chat, I'm pretty sure. Oh, come on. It does empower my dive kick at least, so that's kind of fun. Alright, so it should be Y A B Y, which is what I did, X B. I got trolled earlier. Okay, so let's go ahead and Black Panther around. This is how the game wanted you to enter this dungeon. We went in through the the side entrance chat. We, I don't even know if in our uh, other playthrough we ever came over here. Like, ever. I don't remember. I don't think we did. Take our money bag, I guess. We don't even do enough damage to kill those instantly. It's crazy. All that for a chain mill. We'll fill out the map a little more. I don't have an intent to get a 100% map. Just kind of curious in general what we could find without looking stuff up. Aside from where the hidden item is. Like, I knew which room it was. I just remember where it was in the castle kind of thing. There's the rusty food tin. That connects to this whole room we couldn't do anything in before. I do like the movement here. When you have the panther, the underwater movement is kind of silly. Oh, I can't dive kick. That's right. I'd to do a crazy dive kick downwards. Wow, can you imagine going all this way just to get denied? 
I was about to ask if Devil Enhanced Panther. <laughs> I wish. You can't have both on at the same time. I don't think I have any other hammer items to test this. We used that earlier. Wow, you have to go like the most absurd distance to get to a warp. Yeah, I wish. Yeah, remember when we shortcut it out of this room, chat? Seriously. I'm trying to dive kick and I keep bouncing on them out of the water. It's so sad. Let's get out of here. Got an ice cream from her. That checks out. So let's go kill Puppet Master and then show off the last portion of the map I didn't do. Love that I'm actively poisoning them with something. Is that what Black Panther does? Does it poison things? We apparently found 96% of the map, which to me is funny, because I did not put a lot of effort into unlocking it. So let's go, uh, I guess kill Puppet Master now. No survivors, chat. Like, listen, we could definitely dunk on the final boss at any point, again, if we want to. But we gotta send a message. Succubus glitch? Nope. Oh wait, that's just Lilith. Oh, that's not even the good one. Alright, now here's a good see, this is a good reason when to use devil. When you when you know you can kill everything, you might as well as devil. Like this is the use case that I see, not that I want to do every boss at 10 health. So same thing again. It's not too bad. Oh, that doesn't one shot. Well, that was fast. I definitely pressed the wrong. That time, that was my fault. That was user error. Goodbye, Puppet Master. We leveled on him. That's shameful. There we go. Now we can show off the last thing that I didn't do in definitely any playthrough so far. One last chance to get Lilith. That actually would have boosted Panther. It would have been nice if it was one-shotting some things, but oh well. I can't believe this is the only warp between here and the other area. Like, that to me is insane how far you have to go in order to get there. So we're gonna go right back to where we were before. So there we go, Chad. We went back for the Steam achievements. Which direction I go? Just deleted him. Alright, so normally what you could do is if you have Puppet Master plus Skeleton Abe, you could do this. Or. The thing that I tried doing in our other playthrough and got denied, where is it? A blue ability. Or you could be carried like a king to the next area. Look at us go, chat. Anyway, that's what you're supposed to do here. It's not what we did, though. So we went through this area a little backwards. 
Just curious what's even over here. Obviously nothing of interest because Tear of Blood is there. We could have gotten Serenity Robe. Is that worse than the other armor? That gives in and 60 defense. Okay, so that's just the int version. Okay, so everything still would have been... Oh, God. I guess that's okay. But did all that just to get these little checkpoints out of the way. Bloody stud, which I'm assuming is terrible. Actually, surprisingly not a big defense difference between the two. I like that neck warmer is up there with damage. Anyway, let's go in the corner. What was over here that I couldn't access? A 666 door? Oh, uh, that I would have Succubus glitched into for sure. Oh, well, Chad, I don't think it is meant to be in this playthrough. We tried multiple times to get that Succubus. It did not agree with us. We got Merman right at the end. Cool, I guess. The Invisible Maze. Yeah, I'm not going back through there. No, thank you. Oh, there's a healing potion down here. Sure. I don't think it would have been worth coming here. Monkey list killed. Nice. Although, I don't really want to go through the, the spike area. Changed my mind. At least this time we got super jump. It should be less garbage. I say the hole is like right here. Don't mess with me. I know it is. Game, please. Precision is not my strong suit. What am I, like, okay, I was gonna say, like, as I said before, like, there it is. <laughs> it's a puzzle. Come on, land on the thing. There we go. Definitely intended, chat. We got ghost after we were done with it. Whatever. See, so yeah, I don't feel like going for the 666 rooms or whatever. The nonsense. At least we could do this. This is kind of satisfying. See, so we're basically just gonna get to a save point and we are done with the game for now. Then I guess we'll give an updated review. I haven't decided if I wanted to do Julius mode or not. I don't feel like doing it tonight since I don't feel at my best still. Look at that chat, we missed the stud. Does it matter? Not at all. So I think we showed off the three monsters, which we didn't do last time. We showed where the, the money doors are. The only thing I guess we didn't do is the succubus glitch, which is whatever. Whatever. I got as far as I wanted to go. So let's chat. How do I feel the session went today? Well, aside from awkward de-rust for the first few minutes, I think I got more used to it. I feel like I was more fluid with the post-final boss bosses than the uh, other fights leading to the end of the game. But hey, it's just as cheesy as I remember it. Too many seals, chat. Too many seals. That that also has not really changed. So I'm going to close out of the game for now. And I guess we'll transition into actual final thoughts of how I felt about Dawn of Sorrow as a total experience. But from a YouTube perspective, we're going to say goodbye to YouTube for just a moment. So I guess with that, we're going to say thanks for watching YouTube and see you in the final thoughts.